Step into 2,000 years of history as you explore the most iconic symbol of the ancient world in Rome, the Colosseum. In terms of the tickets, um, as of right now, uh, it's 18 euros for adults and 2 euros for kids from until 18 years old. It's located in the center of Rome at Piazza del Colosseo. Uh, the Colosseum is surrounded by other beautiful famous monuments such as Roman Forum and Palatine Hill. It's easily commutable um, either via Metro, A or B and there are several stop bus stops as well. Uh, just a personal um, experience, um, I mean you can either take a hop on hop off bus um, and this is one of the main stops or you know if you are healthy and fit you can cover the main attractions on foot as well they're, they're, they're not that far like all major tourist attractions the Colosseum security is quite stringent to keep visitors safe uh, visitors are not allowed to enter the monument uh, with large bags suitcases or backpacks if you have pre-booked your tickets, you will get to skip the ticket line, uh, but will still have to wait to go through security. Uh, depending on the day and the time of the year, security can take anywhere from 10 to 60 minutes on average. Uh, because of this, it's, it's always recommended uh, to budget extra time for your visit. A good way to avoid this problem altogether is to go early in the morning. Uh, the Colosseum opens to visitors at about 8.30 a.m. Uh, please do check on the website uh, at the time of visit, uh, 8.30 is as of right now. Uh, and if you do arrive early, you will spend much less time waiting and you will also avoid the intense heat of the Roman summer. The ornate structure is 57 meters tall, built using travertine marble sourced from quarries around Italy. It definitely takes you back to the history um, and you, you can imagine you know how people used to live back in the time Colosseum is made up of stones and concrete it has about 80 entrances and could hold 50,000 spectators it was built in only 9 years by almost 60,000 slaves. Colosseum is considered as one of the 7 wonders of the world. So basically gladiators uh, were the slaves uh, that were used to fight either with each other or with animals for public entertainment. The word Colossus means a huge statue. Amphitheater is derived from Greek word amphitheatron, where amphi means on both sides and theatron means place for viewing. Um, these are the ropes that they used to use back in the days uh, to, to pull the rocks or the stones from one floor to another. Researchers say bones from bears and lions and even horses were probably left by animals that were forced to fight each other and gladiators for entertainment. Smaller animal bones belonging to dogs were also found.
A series of earthquakes during the 5th century damaged the structures. Uh, you can see the broken stones, uh, other broken parts of the building that they were able to find. Uh, they have showcased them here. The most mysterious and fascinating part of the Colosseum is without doubt the Hippogym. For years, archaeologists avoided the labyrinth of tunnels due to its sheer complexity, and it has only been open to visitors since 2021. The backstage of the games is where the gladiators would prepare for battle and wild animals were kept. You can see previously hidden secrets when wandering the Hippogym like the trap doors used to raise lions and other predators into the arena from below. Since the 6th century, the Colosseum has suffered lootings, earthquakes and even bombings during World War II. The Colosseum remained active for over 500 years. The last recorded games in history were celebrated in the 6th century. The Colosseum remained active for over 500 years. The last recorded games in history were celebrated in the 6th century. It is the largest amphitheater to be built during the Roman Empire. It was established by Roman Emperor Vespasian. Colosseum was originally known as the Flavian Amphitheater. Amphitheaters were open air, mostly circular or oval, and could accommodate thousands of spectators. They were the places where performances and events were held for public entertainment.